I like it when a remix kind of destroys the original song and completely changes it and some, you get something unexpected back. That's what I really like. The melody is important to me. It's something that stays in your head, you know, something that you'll be humming for hours. Sort of like a nice earworm, you know. And that's the sort of stuff that's great for remixing because that's something fun to play with. You have to put your mark on it. Uh, and if, you, if you've been asked to do a remix, normally they like what you do, they like your sound. So you have to put your elements on it. What I like to do is to make something that's almost completely new and maybe perhaps not, not recognisable, just to, to see how, how far I can stretch the stems or the individual bits I've been given. I would load them up and play around with them. When I, when I find something I like, I do strip it down. I'd like turn it into, into stems in my own mind. Actually, in a weird way, I use the visuals quite a lot, so I'm actually fitting the shapes together. Like you'll have the, the drums, bass, vocals. I find it quite satisfying to sort of slot the pieces together and use that as a sort of framework for arranging the, the parts. It doesn't always need to be spot on. Like, it doesn't, the beat doesn't need to be perfect or anything, but you can really, you can normally tell if someone, um, if they've really put their like, heart and soul into the, into the piece, and those are people that you want to remix stuff. Because they will, there, uh, yeah, they'll take care of it. They, they'll, it will mean something to them, mm -hmm. um, and that will, you'll hear that. When I finish a remix, it's very satisfying. It feels like you've completed a, a puzzle or something. Uh, it's a very gratifying uh, process. Always push yourself to get it done. It might feel, oh, I'm not in the mood. Get in there. Get it done. <laughs>